Unit 4 The Human Body 1. Skeletal and Muscular Systems Our body is a wonderful machine. It is more complicated than any other machine. It can perform a number of functions. Besides sitting, standing, walking and running, the human body can see, hear, smell, move, grow, breathe and reproduce. No man-made machine is as wonderful as the human body. Internal organs of our body Like a machine, our body is also made up of many parts. The different parts of our body are called organs. Some of the major internal organs of our body are the lungs, heart, kidneys and brain. We cannot see them but we can sense their function. These organs work continuously day and night without rest. These organs are very soft and delicate. They need protection from injury and shock. When we touch our hands, legs, shoulders, etc., we feel soft skin. If we press on these parts more, we feel hard structures. These hard structures are called bones. There are 206 bones in our body. These bones form the framework of the body and protect the soft delicate organs from outside injury and shock. The bones in different parts of the body are different. Some bones are small and some bones are large. The framework of bone is called skeleton. The skeletal system The skeleton is the framework of the body. It gives form, shape and support to our body. It also protects the internal organs. It is because of bones that we are able to stand, sit, walk and move. Parts of a Skeleton The human skeleton consists of different parts like skull, backbone, ribcage, bones of the limbs, etc. One skull. The skull is a bony box formed by eight flat bones fitted together. The skull protects the brain from injury and shock. There are 14 facial bones which form the face. These bones protect the sense organs present in the face that is eyes nose, ears and tongue. Only the lower jaw is movable. This enables humans to chew the food and to talk. Skull Two, Backbone The skull rests on the backbone which is made up of 33 irregular bones which are one on top of the other. 
these bones are called vertebrae and the column of bones is called vertebral column. The backbone protects the delicate spinal cord that runs from brain to the last vertebra. Our backbone is very flexible. It helps us to bend forward or backward. We can also move our body in different directions without bending or moving our legs. Backbone 3. Rib Cage The rib cage is formed by 12 pairs of long curved bones called ribs. These 12 pairs of bones are joined at the back to the backbone and the first 10 pairs are joined in front to the breastbone. The last two pairs of ribs are called floating ribs because they are joined only to the backbone. These form the cage and protect the heart and lungs from injury. Rib cage. Four limbs. There are two pairs of limbs in our body. A pair of four limbs or arms and a pair of hind limbs or legs. The limbs are made up of long bones joined together. Four limb, hind limb. Five. Griddles. There are two pairs of griddles, a pair of shoulder griddles and a pair of hip griddles. The arms are attached to shoulder griddles and legs are attached to hip griddles. So the limbs are not joined directly to the backbone but to griddles. The griddles lie on either side of the backbone and are fixed to it. The longest bone in the body is the thigh bone or femur. Shoulder griddle, hip griddle. Functions of the skeleton. Activity. Observe the skeleton of human body kept in your laboratory. Are all the bones have same shape and size? The skeleton has the following functions. It gives form and shape to the body. It gives support to the body. It protects the delicate organs of the body. The skull protects the brain. The backbone protects the spinal cord. The rib cage protects the heart and lungs. The hip bones protect the kidneys and the bladder. The muscles attached to the skeleton make the movement possible. The long bones of the skeleton are filled with soft material called bone marrow. All the blood cells in our body are made here. The red cells carry oxygen to different parts of the body and white blood cells fight infection. Joints A place where a bone is connected with another bone is called a joint. Bones that meet at a joint are held together by strong tissues called ligaments. There are several joints in our body. Bones in the skull are fixed. So the joints between them do not move. They are called immovable joints. If the bones move at the joints, these joints are called movable joints. There are four types of movable joints. Activities 1. When you sit down to eat, observe 
how your hand moves towards the mouth. 2. When you hold pencil or anything, observe how your fingers move. 1. Hing joint A hing joint is like the hings in a door. It can move the bones only in one direction. We can see these joints at elbow, knee, toe, finger. Activity When you bowl while playing cricket, observe how you rotate your arms in a full circle. 2. Ball and socket joint Ball and socket joint allows the connected bones to move in many directions. In this type of joint, one bone has a hollow socket into which ball of another bone fits. It is found in the hips and shoulders. While playing cricket, the ball and socket joint of the shoulder allows the bowler to change the speed and the direction of the ball. We can swing our arms almost like a wheel because of these joints. Shoulder bones, hip bones. Activity. Observe when you move your head sideways, upward and downward. 3. Pivot joint. This joint is found between the skull and the first two vertebrae of the spine, backbone. This joint allows the head to move sideways, upward and downward. Skull Pivot Joint Activity Imagine if your backbone is made up of only one long bone. How do you look? Can you bend, twist or turn? 4. Gliding joint We can see this joint in the wrist and ankle and between the two vertebra of the spine. It allows only a little movement but in all directions. It helps our back to bend, twist or turn at each joint. Backbone, Ankle, Wrist The muscular system Bones cannot move by themselves. They are attached with the muscles which help all movements of the body. The muscles are attached to the bones by strong fibers called tendons. There are about 650 different muscles in our body. Muscles are used to breathe, eat, digest food and move in any way. In fact, none of the functions of the body can take place without the use of muscles. Types of Muscles According to the structure and functions, muscles are divided into three types. 1. Voluntary Muscles Some muscles in our body which are under our control are called voluntary muscles. The muscles which bring about the movements of the skeleton are voluntary muscles. Muscles of fingers, arms and legs are voluntary muscles. 2. Involuntary muscles Some muscles which are not under our control are called involuntary muscles. These muscles continue to work on their own automatically. Examples are muscles of foot pipe, eyes, blood vessels, 
stomach, intestine, kidney, and urinary bladder. 3. Cardiac muscles. The muscles that help the heart to work day and night are called cardiac muscles. They are quite different from the above two types. These muscles have structure like voluntary muscles but work like involuntary muscles. Voluntary muscles Involuntary muscles Cardiac muscles How do muscles work? Muscles work by contracting and relaxing. When a muscle contracts, it becomes shorter and the bones come closer to each other. When it relaxes, it comes back to its original shape. Muscles work in pairs. In all the free moving joints, the muscles are attached to bones and move these bones into different directions. Because of these movements, we are able to walk, jump and carry things. Each movable joint has two sets of muscles. One to pull the bones up and other to pull the bones back. Care of bones and muscles As bones and muscles perform very different functions, we must take proper care of them. Muscles grow stronger by doing regular exercise, walking, running, swimming, etc. Good eating habits and proper rest must be taken. Taking alcohol, smoking or chewing tobacco or any kind of harmful drugs damage our body. So, well development of muscles make the body look beautiful. Let's revise the important points. 1. Our body works like a machine. 2. Our internal organs are soft and delicate. They need protection from injury and shock. 3. The skeleton gives form and shape to the body and protects the internal organs. 4. The skeletal system is made up of 206 bones. 5. The backbone protects the spinal cord. The skull protects the brain. 6. The bones are connected with each other by joints. 7. The joints in the skull are immovable. There are four kinds of movable joints in our body. They are hing joint, ball and socket joint, pivot joint and gliding joint. 8. Movement is brought about by the action of muscles on bones. 9. Muscles are of three kinds. Voluntary, involuntary and cardiac muscles. 10. For proper growth and development of our body, regular exercise and good eating habits are necessary.